What are some other things that you are excited about uh, multimodality and maybe like things that you're thinking about? Yeah, one of the first tools we gave it is a browser tool. And so it's ability to, to look at a website and a web application. I think there's a lot of other multimodal software development tasks where being able to check your own work in a tight iterative loop will be an important thing. So I, I think we're trying to look at how to do uh, like mobile engineering, I mean, even desktop applications. Web was really kind of a, a proof of concept to make sure we got the loop working. Thanks, Channing. No problem. This was a quick tour of multimodal capabilities in Codex. We know models perform better when they can check their own work. And previously, we could only do that with backend code. But now, by harnessing the multimodal and agentic capabilities of GPT-5 Codex, we've also unlocked that for front-end coding. And we hope this gives you some ideas for how you can pair with Codex as a creative partner. To get started, go to chatgpt.com slash codex. Thanks for watching.